Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Today, question from a viewer. Uh, Gulermi Nozaki. Um, and I'll tell you the question in a second. Stay tuned. All right, so Mr. Nozaki uh, is asking, uh, hey man, how, how are you, how you doing? How are you doing? Uh, do you know why all the pros use white overgrips? Um, Mr. Nozaki brings up a great point. If you look at most of the pros on tour, uh, you see them playing, you see them in pictures, you see them, you know, magazines, um, online, wherever. Most of the time, they're, they're using a white overgrip, like one of these, right? Probably the most commonly used is um, the Wilson Pro Overgrip, the Yonex Super Grap, um, the Babolat one. Uh, some use that Megatac. Um, but why? Why white? Um, well, here is why, how it was explained to me. Um, I know that when people walk in here, um, especially women, I, they have a white grip to start and it gets all grimy and dirty. Um, and they're like, ooh, uh, I don't want my white grip to look like that anymore. So can you put a black overgrip on? And I was like, sure. Uh, and I say, and I, but I also say, I was like, did you know though, that if you want a tacky grip, white would be way better. Okay. So the way it was explained to me from all the companies when white was introduced years ago was white retains its tackiness more. So it sticks to your hand better, right? As the color deepen in the overgrip, you know, a la blue, pink, green, orange, um, black. The deeper the color, the less tacky, well, the less tackiness it retains because the more dye has to go into it. So it basically has to absorb the color, therefore reducing the tackiness the stickiness on your hand. So if you've ever had a white grip and a black grip, um, go ahead and feel it. I'll bet you, you can feel the difference. A black grip tends to be more slippery and less kind of an adhesive feeling to your hands. Whereas a white grip, you can actually feel the tackiness that's trying to, to kind of stick to you. Um, and it kind of has a more of a natural feel too. Uh, whereas a black one feels more kind of rubbery synthetic. Um, and I'm talking about the same grip. Um, as you know, my, you know, my favorite overgrip right now is this Dunlop Super Tack. It comes in both black and white. Um, you can definitely feel the difference between the black and the white. Uh, the white just feels more natural. It's more stretchy. It's softer. Um, it, it even feels a little bit more cushiony. Um, it doesn't feel as, I don't, the, other, the only word I can think of on the black grip is maybe a little stiffer. Um, it's a little firmer uh, without the tackiness. Uh, there's also a reason why a lot of these grips, um, or Wilson actually, they don't make in black. Right? Have you ever seen a pro overgrip that's not the sensation, which is the thin one, in black? Like to my knowledge, pro overgrip has never been made in black. They make all the other colors of the rainbow, but not black. Uh, because I believe that they feel that black takes away from the natural tackiness, the natural feel um, of the grip itself. So that's why you see Roger using white. That's why you see Rafa using white. That's why you see, here, let's go over to these, right? 
That's why you see Novak using white, right? That's why you see Roger using white. And you guys seen my Nadal racket, he uses white too. So white is the choice of the pros. Um, then again, they always change it after every use though. So that's why they sell them in the multi-packs, the 30 packs, because if you want that fresh feel, um, you change your overgrip. And I, I kind of categorize that um, as kind of changing your diaper, you know, you know, when you, when you have a fresh diaper, you got that fresh feel, right? Once you do your thing in that diaper, you know, you touch it and it's like, Oh, you know, it's not, I don't get that fresh feel anymore. So that's why they sell them in the multi packs, right? So that you can have that fresh feel every day, right? Cause Roger, when that fleet of rackets go in for stringing, they all get new overgrips too. Um, if you, I mean, if you guys are having problems hanging on to the racket, change that grip more often. It'll definitely benefit you, you know, hanging on to that racket, giving you that fresh feel and making sure the racket stays in your hand. Um, and it kind of just makes a more enjoyable experience for you too, when you can actually um, feel that nice, tacky, soft, new feel in your hand, especially with a white grip. So if you've never tried a white grip and think it's dirty, um, give it a try. I bet you it'll put a grip on your tennis. All right. Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.